The peacekeeping of the past were, were based in, let's say, ceasefire. This is not happening, this mission. This mission, the peacekeeper that is deployed here, he must be prepared to fight. India has been an example of commitment to the United Nations Charter. The contribution you have made to inspiring Liberian women that protect the nation, for that we will always be grateful. So we as peacekeepers, we have to operate into the remotest of areas. Either we are operating with the helicopters or we are operating by riverine patrols. I was really inspired by women of this country in such a hard situation. They are still trying to collaborate, uh, integrate and sort of uh, bring a movement. Sometimes you move in some other our area of operation in different missions, you, you will somewhere and then you see that it, no one can live there and then you found a detachment or an Indian company. We've lost lives uh, in almost every UN mission. This loss of life has been in protecting, not in combat. This is where I think Indians have really stood up. Indian troops by nature are a people's army. They know how to reach out to people. When we move along a road or street, there is a, you see suddenly a bunch of kids, they're smiling and waving hands towards you. Uh, then you realize that you are here for peace and you are the ambassador of peace. <laughs>